let's use the first derivative test to find the critical point. And also use the derivative to justify why the function is increasing or decreasing along different intervals. Well, the derivative of this function is equal to 2 by x minus 1. And if you set that equal to 0, the x value with the slope of the tangent to the curve is 0, is equal to 1. And then substituting x equals 1 into our original function, then y of 1 is equal to 3. So that's our critical point. And we can also observe from the derivative that for x is less than 1, then the slope of the tangent to the curve is negative, and therefore the function is decreasing. And for x greater than 1, we can see that the slope of the tangent to the curve is positive, and therefore the function is increasing.